Hi, I'm Jennifer from Workroom Social, and today I'm going to show you how to apply bias tape. So we have our bias tape made. You can either make this at home or you can um, buy pre-made bias tape at any Notions or sewing store. Um, and so the first thing you're going to want to do is take your bias tape and this would be the right side of the bias tape and this would be the wrong side. You're going to lay your bias tape right side down. Then what you're going to do is you're going to go to the raw edge on the right, which is folded in, and you're going to unfold it. Then you're going to line up the raw edge with the raw edge of your fabric. And you can pin your bias tape in place to help you control all of this fabric before you start sewing. The bias tape is quite stretchy, so pins are a good idea when you're doing bias tape. Okay, so I have my bias tape pinned in place. And now I'm gonna sew the bias tape on, and I'm gonna sew just to the right of the fold in the bias tape. So the fold is gonna be on the left and my stitching is going to be on the right. And so we're just doing a straight stitch. Um, I'm using a 2.5 millimeter stitch length. And we're just gonna go all the way down. Okay. Now when you come to the end, you can just stop. Um, if you're using pre-made bias tape, you'll get it um, on a roll. You might get a couple yards at once. So I don't usually pre-cut my bias tape. I will apply it and then when I get to the end, I'll cut off the ends. So I'm using exactly what I need. Okay, so now you can see our stitching is just to the right of the fold so that when we fold this back over, it's right on that line. Okay, now the next step, we're gonna take this whole thing, the bias tape, and we're gonna fold everything over. And from here, we're gonna pin this in place and then sew it down. Now, there's two ways that you can kind of think about bias tape. Bias tape can be used on the inside of a garment. So if you pretend this yellow is a neckline, for example, the pink bias tape could be on the inside of the neckline. So you don't see it at all. It's just to clean finish um, your raw edge. But you can also sew it so that the pink or the, the bias tape is on the outside and so it's a little bit more decorative. Um, so either way is fine, it's totally up to you. But we're just gonna stitch this down just like this right now. And of course you can use pins, we'll use pins to hold everything in place since this is pretty stretchy. Okay, and then we're just gonna stitch right on the edge here. Okay, so this is folded now and stitched down. You take this to the iron and give it a good press. And when you did that, if this were the right side of your garment, you would have no bias tape showing. It would just be on the inside. Or if you wanted to use the bias tape on the outside of your garment, then you have a really fun, nice contrasting edge to your garment. So that's how you sew bias tape. Thank you.